All right, so we're back at our local Salvation Army. Look, we have a Buddha right here doing some morning stretches. Looks pretty cool. Not very old, made in China, $9.99. Not for me. And what else do we see here? They like to separate it by color. Uh, a Copa Pelli. Interesting. Little Delft Bowler Cup. Interesting. Cheap. Hmm. Oh, here is a vintage mug right here. Yeah. From RBC or back then, Royal Bank of Canada, their old logo. Uh, mug is probably from the 70s, maybe 80s. Oh, some Starbucks mugs from Portland. Looks pretty new. Oh, $4.99. That's expensive. And here from San Diego, same thing. I looked these up, they're not very valuable. Some of them can be. Oh, look at this decanter, mm, very heavy. Heavy glass and pewter fittings. Missing the top though. Mm. Oh, Norman Rockwell. Looks like someone donated a whole collection of them. Great American painter. Always look for the antique stuff. Oh, some brass in the brassware. Look at this sailboat. Reminds me of stained glass. Hmm, made in India. $4.99. Oh, this clock. It's not real. Sometimes you have those anniversary clocks that are actually wind up. Those are cool. Usually from Germany, West Germany. Back then when there was two Germanys. Always check the silverware for real silver. And here are the knickknacks. Ooh, Cobra, six ninety nine. Hmm, some cool stuff here sometimes. Those are neat. Bunch of little blue and white. Oh, scary, argoil. Just made of resin. Oh, those some Japanese carvings, some other carvings. Oh, look at these cups. Pretty cool. $3.99. Hmm. Oh, Coca-Cola stuff. Hmm, candles. $4.99. Oh, who's pricing these things? I would think it'd be worth like $1.99 here. And more knickknacks. These bags are cool. A lot of belt buckles. Pretty cool ones, too. Wow. Ooh. American flag, sort of. I guess these could be worth some money to someone. Oh, oh what the heck? Oh, oh, it's just a belt buckle. We got three bucks each. Probably Coin Picker Jr. would love these. Weird. Any other goodies? Oh, what is this? Dex Station Samsung. I looked this up and they comp around $30 to $40. But again, I'm not a reseller. I think there was like missing cable. Look like a very good condition. Not brand spanking you though. What is in here? Oh, Sears. Oh, this is a bicycle odometer. Speedometer? Odometer? Uh, Vintage-y, I don't know, probably from the 70s. Made in Japan. Um, not much value, though. I did check it out. And it's like maybe $15. It was all over the place. Don't know if this one's actually worth anything. Huh, put it back. Well, I love the old collectibles. And always check the games. Oh, this is pretty neat. This is retro. Yep. Fun. And oh, John Cena. Free DVD with their magazine. I tried to look this up, couldn't find it, uh, anything, but um, I don't know, probably not much value. Meccano. This looks new in the box. Hmm. 
Where, where? Okay. Look at this stuff here. Maybe you want to tell me Now, <laughs> this is when I get okay. busted by the part timer. Yep. You need help, huh? No? Check this out. A lot of knickknacks. Did you take a picture of everything? Heck yeah, I'm gonna film everything because that's how coin picker rolls. No, I'm just kidding. I didn't really say that. I just said I, I'm just taking pictures for fun, for my own enjoyment. You know, like I've been doing this for a long time, especially at this store, and all the other staff, they're pretty cool about it and they, you know, joke around with me, never make a fuss, but you get this uh person that's here once a week and usually she works at the other stores i guess she's getting extra hours here and she starts pulling the you know that's against our store policy blah 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 and this was like five minutes before closing while she is already off duty and about to walk out of the store and she busts me seriously anyways i just won't do it around her uh, i hope you enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe Coin picker out.